Hey everybody, uh, I'm Jared Fortney and I'm a Group Networks Consultant. Today we're going to do a brief introduction on um, Primavera P6, give you an idea of what um, the feature has to hold and what we'll be discussing. So to start off, well, we're going to talk about you know, where Primavera started. Uh, Primavera has been around since 1983 and uh, was launched by Primavera Systems based out of uh, Bala Kenwood, Pennsylvania. I've actually been there for training and uh, you can see the map here. It's just a bit outside of Philadelphia. And, uh, you know, Primavera kind of got its start here. Um, almost everyone uh, that worked for Primavera still works there and uh, they basically started this program from from the ground up and developed a enterprise project management solution for uh, for construction which I believe began with uh, SureTrack which is one of the really really older versions of Primavera but um, officially P6 is named Primavera P6 Professional Project Management and it is uh, an enterprise project portfolio management uh, software. You'll see EPPM referred to a lot. Um, the third bullet here that we're going to discuss is part of Oracle Primavera's um, EPBM solution. Now, I'd say probably about five, six years ago, it's uh, about 2008, Oracle purchased Primavera systems and uh, added them to their suite of products. Now, when I say suite of products, it means that, you know, Primavera had a number of products that didn't just uh, focus specifically on project management but portfolio management, risk management. So currently Primavera um, the project portfolio management software includes or the suite includes Primavera P6 Enterprise Project Portfolio Management which would be a number of projects grouped into one portfolio. Um, Primavera P6 Project uh, professional project management, which is what we're focused on. Uh, Primavera P6 Analytics, Primavera Portfolio Management, Primavera Contract Management, and uh, Business Intelligence Publisher Edition. There's also Primavera Risk Analysis, Primavera Inspire for SAP, and Primavera Earned Value Management, and Primavera Contractor. We're going to we're going to focus mainly on the on the Primavera P6 professional project management. One of the main questions that we'll want to answer here about P6 is, you know, what does P6 do? Now, the focus of the of Primavera EPPM software is basically to allow organizations to manage their programs and projects effectively regardless of the complexity or scale of 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 their projects so even at a small level of complexity or granularity you could manage uh, one project or you could scale it up to hundreds of projects and group them into portfolios and that's where the uh, portfolio management software comes in but basically the the software provides an end-to-end -end real-time visibility for all the corporate information that you would need to inform uh, the upper management you know that's managing the portfolios so that they can make good business decisions and that they can uh, basically get a grasp on their current resources and ensure that each individual project team um, has all of the resources and and um, and the 
and the information that they need on any particular project. So P6 isn't just about scheduling. I mean, it, it really is about total project management. It, when you incorporate it with something uh, like Contract Manager, it truly is a uh, total project management solution where you can track uh, anything down to a phone call. You know, someone called the called the office today, and it it pertained to this WBS um, level, and we're going to record that. So, you know, P6 is very often on you know re referred to as a scheduling tool, which uh, I think is a bit restrictive when you really look at the reality of it it you know you could you could use primavera p6 as a as a total project management tool for any project would it do absolutely everything you needed to do no but i would say 75% of everything you need is in there and there is some overlap with contract manager and other tools but you know, for the most part, you could do a very good job of uh, documenting and managing your project if you were just using P6 as a tool solely. Uh, you know, recently they've added some 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 new uh, developments to the P6 realm, and uh, one of those is the new release, which is 8.2, which was you know considered a major upgrade. It offers a lot of new capabilities for governance, uh, project team participation, and project visibility. There's also P6 Web, which is a web-based uh, version. I don't want to call it a version because all of the P6 Web is actually administrated via the the uh, the regular interface, which would be the standalone installation of P6. So the client server version of of P6 is still where all of the P6 web would be administrated from which I believe is uh the change from version P6 version 5 to version 6 was was really quite seamless because all they really did is change the back end or the database to be able to accept the web uh information and for all intents and purposes, the client server application, it really only changed for administrators. The uh, the majority of the functionality didn't change at all. So really only the areas where an administrator would go were, were the areas that were affected by the, the uh, implementation of P6Web. Um, it looks like uh, they've also created a what's called P6 Team Member which is an iPhone application and they're using that to streamline communications between project team members in the field and the personnel in the office it looks as if that application is something that the people in the field can update the schedule with automatically without having to discuss the update directly with the uh, with the office personnel. And finally it looks like uh, they have released a Primavera P6 analytics release uh, which I imagine I'm not personally familiar with this but I I would probably say that this is a reporting and analytics software that allows you to run custom reports against the Oracle database to give you more flexibility with reporting and answer some of uh, your more complicated questions. Okay, once again, my name is Jared Fortney and I am a Group Networks Consultant and this was an introduction to Primavera P6. I'll see you in a later lesson. Thank you.